Look who's here, Joan Van Ark, Michelle Lee, and Donna Mills were at the Holland Museum at the opening of their Knott's Landing 40th Anniversary Lobby exhibit with lots of the cool wardrobe that they wore in the iconic show in the cul-de-sac. What I don't love about this is the museum aspect. I'm thinking, <laughs> oh, too young to be here in a museum. That's right. But let's talk about the clothes. I am adorable here, and this is the way I usually look. No, I will you tell remember, you if you, you can see this. This is a hand-done sweater, the Knott's Landing shoulders that we had. I think I wore this in a scene camping with my husband. Camping? camping. This is you went gorgeous. camping in like I'm this? I'm lying. Okay. Wait. <laughs> I'm lying. But I think I would. See the one in the back? I, I was shot in this one. Shot? shot. S H. Right. OT. And you love to be shot. Remember, we talked about how you like to be. Oh, you're, yeah. Yes, no, you're, you're very know good why? at being shot. I like being shot because when you see my body go into. <laughs> the movement. Yes. They know I was a dancer. Yes. What do you remember I about the clothes? Dancer. You got all the great clothes, right? Yes. Yes. I did. So well, we look, I mean, that's an Armani suit. That's an Armani suit. I had a Scada, I had Trevia, I had um, yeah, everybody, you know. What about Belline? Because Belline didn't always get to be glammed up. Not at all did she get to be glammed up. They, there's a reason they called her poor, poor Val. Val, okay? But in these two outfits, I think this was one of the uh, like reunion efforts mm -hmm. because I would wear this almost like a cat suit. I would wear this today, and in fact, I asked if I could wear it, to today, wear it today, and they said no. It's in it the. Has to be involved. It. In the <laughs> However, the hair looks like I put my finger into a, an electric light socket, and it came out this way. Too much with the wind machine here. The one behind it, I would also wear today because I think it's hearts and flowers, and with a pair of fabulous boots uh, and a big fat smile, I, I would definitely wear the flowered dress. Were you ever like, I wish I could get glammed up? I'm tired of oh. being in these pigtails and whatever. I would sneak out from the wardrobe department, Nicolette Sheridan's outfits and Donna Mills' outfits, because those are the ones. Those are the ones that are good for the red carpet. Me, it was great at Kmart or maybe in the kitchen. So, so that my my wardrobe was of that ilk. Michelle, would you ever, would any of you, when you got the wardrobe, were you ever like, no, I won't wear this? I picked out. She asked me the question. <laughs> yeah. We had, we had wonderful wardrobe people who would bring us things and sometimes designers. And if we didn't like exactly how it fit or whatever, it was, we were always told we could say, we love it, but can we see something else? That's basically what the it was. The other thing, and I know Donna did, did this too, is going to Neiman Marcus with the uh, wardrobe assistant and picking them out there and uh, trying them on at Neiman Marcus, having it pinned, saved a lot of time. And if we had the time in our shooting schedule to get over to Neiman's and do that, that, was, that shows you the kind of collaboration that we had on our show. Mm -hmm. God bless. And you always loved what you wore or were you like, no? Oh no, I wouldn't wear it if I didn't love it. Right. Yeah. <laughs> so I, absolutely. And I would go and shop too. And I would really spend almost one day a week getting the, because there'd be days when there were eight outfits in one show. And, and that's a lot of work, mm -hmm. getting that many outfits right for the scene, for the colors, everything else. So um, that was, you know, a, a day spent at Neiman Marcus, not a bad thing to do, but, um, but it was a lot of work. Mm -hmm. What do you think about that they did this honor here at the museum in honor of Knott's Landing? Well, I think it's wonderful that everybody seems to be celebrating our, our 40th anniversary. I mean, everywhere you go, we are. Um, so it really, it, it, it gives us gratitude that everybody is remembering the show that was so good. So good. And anybody in the LA area can just pop on in and see these in person. Yes, I hear it's gonna be running for at least three months, for yes. sure. And you getting this honor here and being it's celebrated? It's lovely. It's lovely. You know, you have to be grateful that a show you did 40 years ago is still remembered and still loved. And um, all of us are grateful for that. Come by the Hollywood Museum.